Our first project was to develop the Eagle Observatory in North Harris and that brings nearly six or seven thousand people a year into Harris specifically to view the Golden Eagles. Hushnish Gateway was a project we completed a couple of years ago. That's a, a tourist and uh, local services building which provides toilets and showers and local information oh. for visitors. Uh, the project came about because the local community down there was struggling with the volume of visitors each year. Um, we have a big issue here with affordable housing and an opportunity came up to buy a care unit from the local council and leader funding helped us redevelop that into two homes which now provides accommodation for two local families. We've just completed a woodland observatory and that is providing a tourist destination to attract more people into one of the quieter areas in Harris. So we're stimulating economic growth. Um, when we talk to funders on the mainland, they don't necessarily know the remote rural geography we work in. It's a challenge to build something uh, and get it funded, but it's an even bigger challenge to build it so far off the beaten track. Uh, leader funding is very important for our projects. It specifically targets community development, so it's perfect. And once secured, it makes match funding so much easier. Our project here is to build a cafe with a catering kitchen, a craft area, a training kitchen, an office and a changing places toilet, all in the one building. Started some 20 years ago and there was a single polytunnel on the site and it's just grown steadily since. We're constructing a 1.4 million pound building. So here we are inside the Grimsay Boat Haven. This is the shed that houses six exemplars of the Grimsay boats uh, from Morning Star, which is the, the largest of the boats that they built, all the way through to a small dinghy. Morning Star was the uh, mail boat for the Monarch Isles, uh, and she's been the subject of numerous restoration projects. These new spaces are really going to help us to reach more people and to tell them uh, about our story. So when visitors are coming to the Western Isles, Grimsay can really give them a, a great value experience, learning about the Grimsay boats, following the Grimsay boat trail, visiting the boat shed, Callan Shellfish, Ewist Walk. Our project is fairly large for our context, but when you go to national funding bodies, we are actually quite small and we kind of fall between the gaps a bit. LEADER were a really important part of our funding strategy in helping to get this project going. 